All right, well, I did just lose the Ankh, but I did get a clone gun. Are there any interesting things that I could try cloning? Not gonna clone a ton. Um, I was also wondering if I could clone something twice. So that's something else I would like to check out. Shopkeeper killed me earlier. Ooh, I could try cloning Monty. That could be fun. Can I get to the dog easily? Somewhat. Especially if I get rid of a fish or two. Okay, there's one fish gone. Yeah, it's probably enough. Nope, not enough. And if I put Monty down there, I need to put him somewhere else. I don't have good shoes for this. There we go. Uh, hmm. Is there a better place to put him? I still have a couple of minutes due to the clover. Um, there's not a good place to set him down. Uh, here, this will work. Okay. Can we clone Monty? The answer is yes. Can we clone him again? Yes! <laughs> oh! Alright, the gun went away again. Whenever I cloned him, it ended up being a new, fresh copy that was sitting. So this is interesting. And actually, I could get a whole bunch of blood this way, too. <laughs> Since I have the Kapala. Alright, so I'll be getting lots of- I wonder if there's going to be multiple Montes now at the exit? Like, how is that going to work? Um, I'll take some more blood. But now I've whipped both of you guys twice. So I should stop. But this will be interesting. What's going to appear at the exit? I don't know. And I should make sure I grab the shotgun, too. I still have a few seconds. Okay. So gently. <laughs> so are we going to see four Montes at the exit? This will be really interesting. I can't wait. Yes! We see four Montes at the exit. That's great. And they all give me a lick. <laughs> okay, well that part was totally worth it. Neat. And I guess at this point... I should just go see if I can find anything new in Neo Babylon, I suppose. Let's see, I've used the Ankh. Yeah, that seems like the best thing to try to do, if I can. Uh, I don't have any bombs, which is kind of a problem. It's not the biggest problem in the world, but it would be it would be nice if things were different. All right. Ah, uh, this is the lava level, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so we're just gonna go to the exit here. I don't know if there's anything interesting on this level 4-4 in the tide pool. Not spent a lot of time here. Probably not. Okay. Let's get rid of some easy bad guys to take out from a distance. Ooh. Okay, don't fall on spikes. And also don't fall on you. I don't even have spike shoes. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, let's do that in case it's important. I don't know that it is. All right. I think there could be a shopkeeper over here. Eh, maybe not. Oh, there's something in the way. And the shopkeeper just died, probably to a spear trap. And unfortunately, I shot the dog. Well, that's a shame. All right, but we make it to the ice caves. And all of a sudden, my game froze up for a minute. Oh gosh, we angered Kali, but she's still pleased with me. Hooray. Oh, cool. I blew up <laughs> that thing. Uh, the mecha suit or whatever it is. That's something fun. Oh gosh, okay. Oh right, I have the Kapala. I should be trying to get blood. Blood is good. Um, 
blowing stuff up is fun, too. Let's do some more of that. I never do vaults. And so maybe maybe now I should start. <laughs> um, if I got one more explosive thingy, I could do it. Uh, is there an explosive thingy around? Yeah, this one will work. Since we're just kind of playing around. Hiya! Alright. Shopkeeper dead. As he should be. And inside here. Oh, I can see uh, Waddler down below, I believe. Ooh. I guess it's just because we're in the ice caves we got a diamond. I Maybe vaults have diamonds. I have almost never robbed them in this game for whatever reason. Guess we haven't really ever focused on money. Okay, so that's a Waddler. Um, let's grab some health really quick. And... Is there anything I want to leave with Waddler? I can carry your items deeper in the ice cave for you. Um, oh, even deeper. So this is interesting. I hadn't thought about this. Like, I thought about picking things up from here. Oh, I've also... I've never fought Waddler. Okay, so you can fight him. He drops a compass and a key. It's the things that you see inside of him. All right, that's interesting. All right, I can get some more blood out of this. And then... Do I have climbing gloves? I do. So another thing I want to do is not go through the yetis and instead just kind of like climb down the sides of the ice caves. Like, is there anything to see here in the middle section? It doesn't seem like there is. I'm just curious to climb up the other side, too. Yeah, I don't see anything. Oops. Well, I used my parachute. So there's nothing obvious floating in the middle, either. And I don't think there's anything we need to get from that end. Uh, there might be a shopkeeper at the end of this, so let's be ready for that. Uh, sure, give me some more blood. I suppose these little, like, fireflies probably also have blood. Yes, yeah, so I can get a little bit of blood that way. Oh, crap! Okay. <laughs> Alright. Hey, I got some bombs! I don't believe it. Bombs, they exist. That's where we would come out of the ice caves. And that's where there would have been a shopkeeper, but he's not here because he fell out of the world. And there's a Monty, but I already have enough life, so we're not going to worry about it. Instead, we're just going to go to Neo Babylon. We are not going to hit the ghost spot right at the beginning. That would be bad. We have three bombs, so we can't really rely on them. But we do have a shotgun and a jetpack. So those are some nice assets. I don't really remember this place all that well. I guess it's kind of coming back to me, though. Okay. Yep, okay. Right, I should have gone for some blood there, probably. Oh! Okay. <laughs> Everything's fine. That's not a problem. A few explosions never hurt anybody. We just made the game more fun. Oh gosh! You have lasers, I remember. Okay, let's shoot you again. There you go. Alright, you scream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Laser Screamy Guy, I'm pretty sure is his official name. Alright, so this is a very far up and down y thing, Madugar. Pretty sure that's also the official name of those mechanisms. Alright, Screamy Guy's up there. Uh, the exit's over here. There's probably still gonna be a shopkeeper. Some more screaming. That's just in case the shopkeeper somehow gets blown up or something. Oh boy, there's a laser thingy there. Yeah, it shoots, okay. Oh boy, and there's also a spinny gadoogled. Okay, oh boy. There's the laser. Uh, you know what? Even though I only have three bombs, here comes the laser. I'm gonna do this just to make sure we get rid of the shopkeeper. Great. Fantabulous. Um, but um, but um, but um. Okay, blew something up. Or somebody did, somewhere. I'm sure it's all good. 
If I shoot the base of these things, it doesn't reflect back. Okay. So I guess I want to go down here. Sure. Give me some blood. Uh, I could do the same with you. Come on. Oh, crap. Okay. Electricity and my jetpack probably don't go together well. Let's try to avoid that combination of thingies. And I think I want to go this way. Oh, I see the... Uh, okay. There's many threads. Alright, I see I need to thread the needle down here. Like... <gasps> okay. Like that. Okay. Great. I know I need to go to the right. Just taking a peek. Let's hope bullets don't come flying back. That's just in case there's a shopkeeper over there we could hit. I see the shopkeeper. I think I can fly above his head. Oh crap. Okay. Well, that'll work. <laughs> I was going to try to jump on his head, but also just having him walk away. Uh, you hear the sounds of revelry, so I think that's uh, Madam Tusk's um, nightclub or whatever it is. And I think I can thread the needle down here, although there's a shooty thing. Okay. Oh boy. Stressful. Alright, there's Madame's. And I don't believe I have any of the necessary... Ooh! Hey, the bodyguard might die just to environmental hazards. Yeah, I wonder if I can walk in there now. Should I try it? It's something different. Oh, crap! Well, I didn't see that one coming. Was it the shotgun that he dropped that got flung into me? I'm not even sure exactly what happened there. In any case, the Four Montes definitely makes that a clip worth seeing. I hope, as always, that you guys are having a great day. And I will see you again soon with more Splunky 2.